we are going to be making more money and akaya today first you can use any or any beans you like i'm using lakai's beans they are just add some water i first soak it for three hours and then started peeling it but some people do like soak it for one hour and bliss it in the blender which i'm not confident doing that i'm not confident doing that but i soak this for three hours then after i started peeling it with my hand the, with a little bit of force then you can this method take longer but it's more secure i already i trust this method then cleaning the, um cleaning it changing the water up to like four times then you can see that it started looking white without any stain there then add more water to it clean it until the beans is pure white then i'm going to be using this red pepper you can use the red pepper or tatashi then just cut it in a very small so that it's going to be easy for you to blend it then i'm going to be using lodo that chili if you haven't got the lodo scotch bonnet or chili pepper and some diced onion white onion we do a red onion then just cut it small to be there cut a little bit smaller add everything together we are going to put, add it to the beans after the beans is being washed you see the beans is more white i share the beans into two one for momoya and one for the akara then i'm going to be adding little water to it at the time for the momoya the water is, is going to feel like it's running when you add the water you need to add enough water but i'm going to leave the recipe of amount of water you're going to put in it as well then after then i'm going to add the salt to it the nutmeg then the the crayfish the crayfish give it a very nice flavor that is the key of momoi then i'm going to add the vegetable oil that's give it like nice good shiny things any bouillon we do but in this case i was using beef bouillon to give it because i like because i haven't got like a meat that like some people put on like a small small piece of meat but i haven't got that in it i just use the beef bouillon then just mix it mix it to to, to make it look smooth then i need to be portioning now things container that i'll put in there i'll punch portion it but i made a mistake i supposed to put oil on the tin foil for the moment to come out but i did forget to put it but in next if you are doing it remember to put the oil in it then i got a add boiled egg i'm adding i cut it into like four then i'm adding add boil in you can use any meat or fish but in this case i'm using micro fish then i'm covering it with clean film clean film just to not just the water and what i get into it then I first put water in the container and some of the tin foil as well, void paper. Then I put some underneath so that it will just so that it will not burn. Then the steam can just come up because actually we are steaming this. This is a steaming process. This method is good when you haven't got a steamer. You can only use the system to stand as a steamer. The cooking process can take up to forty-five minutes and one hour 30 minutes mostly because different sizes and different shape i think it's all done but you can check it you can see that it's all formed together then that is it it's looking good then for the aka for the akara it's the same method of way of blending but i put less legs water compared to the momoi because the akara is so easy then the akara you only, you only add the salt to it at the end when you're about to fry it i only add salt to it nothing else then that is when they are just frying the vegetable oil which is look good then you can see then the akara has a very you have to make it not too running at all to be able to look good to be able to form otherwise if you add the salt early it's going to split it then that is all done that is your momoi and akara ready Thank you guys for watching. Bye.